Alrighty. So here is the Dodger. It looks a little messy right now because I still have to do all of the edges and the bottoms and figure out the zippers. This side piece, I'm gonna actually raise up so that it's up as high as this. So I'm gonna cut and raise that to about that height for the glass. And then I just kind of made it bigger because I wasn't sure of the width of the of all this exactly because the screen was really hard to but this turned out really good this front bit and I'm gonna go up there and I'll show you I'll show you from also behind <clears throat> show you from behind also uh, this is the screen that I also sewed um, there'll be a zipper in between there and then this will have a zipper there and there on either side of the pole and I might make like a some sort of a canvas piece that comes off the back here. Here it is inside of the enclosure. I am so pleasantly surprised. I mean, this glass didn't line up exactly perfect with this, but that's okay. They kind of line up together. Sort of, this one might be a little lower, but whatever. I'm not a professional. But anyways, so yeah, that right there. Been wanting to film this forever because we didn't get a chance to do this on Norna when we were trying to remove the through hole on here. We didn't have all the tools, so we had to do it with what we had. But this is the proper way. A little bit slower turning drill would be better. Right. But you gotta hang Can you on slow that drill? This thing just came around, wow, hit me in the neck. Oh, Jesus. Uh, it's variable speed, but. Yeah, but you gotta be careful of the trigger. Yeah. So I'm already through the, I'm already through the metal now. So what did you just do, Pete? <laughs> oh, see, now I'm hitting fiberglass. Ugh. I put a wood block in there. In the through hole? Yeah, first. So I can drill it out because that's the easiest way to get, get it out of there. Let me get a hammer and a chisel and knock the ring off. This is the proper way to take a through hole out if you have to do it this way. I think uh, Pete couldn't get to the inside or something, he said, of this boat we're working on. Well, as long as you're not trying to save the through hole. Right. These are not worth saving. These are... Yeah, they're done. I mean, they're bronze, but they're... This is a beater chisel. Now, once this is off, now there's nothing holding that through hole now. Right. Because I basically drilled out the... And you can make a really cool necklace. <laughs> but I can't really beat it in yet because... You can't get to it or something, didn't you say? No, I just got to cut the hose. The hose is holding it on there. Oh, okay. But if I had everything loose, you could just smash this in now because nothing's holding it. Right. Because I drilled just perfectly. That's actually the through hole ring now is gone. Right. That's where you threaded it on. You can yeah. even see the threads. Oh, yeah. And so now the hole is really the same size as it was, too. In this case, I'm gonna actually drill out the, the fiberglass a little just to get clean fiberglass. Yeah, because it's pretty. This boat. So it'll be. Yeah. I mean, it'll make it come out easier too. So it'll be that much bigger than the old hole, but. Right. That's not really that bad. All right, I'm leaving if you're grinding fiberglass. Ooh. I'm gonna drill all the way through the hole now. Ew. Okay. So basically, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fold this over, like so, and I'm gonna sew a zipper on both of these. Sew a zipper on both of these, and I'm going to do that first. Then once I have the zipper and I can go zip with this, then I'll put it back up here and align it with this on either side here. So that'll stay. This I'm going to raise up. I marked it, so this is going to go up here a little higher, like right about there along the whole way, and that'll be better. 
I'm gonna add whatever I cut off here down to the bottom. This I'm gonna raise because I put the pieces of wood across here and I want this the way the Isinglass sits it just touches right there which is great it fits great but I need enough room because the pieces of wood are about yay high so I need enough room for snaps or something to go on the pieces of wood and not on the deck itself um, which is perfect for the screens but anyway so I'm gonna raise this up I'm gonna raise this up about this high I'll do it on both sides Let's see here. it's hard to do this shit when I did. okay so raise it up so I've got you know some umbrella to be able to put snaps in um, and then I'm gonna fold this over. I'm gonna fold this over like so, so it's nice and neat too. And these two edges here are actually pretty good. So I would say if I folded this and prepared it for a zipper. Now the zipper on this one only comes down to here because this is, and the rest will be a snap or something down along there. So it's just going to be zipper, or maybe it could be zipper all the way down. I don't know. It depends on how this is going to get attached. So this will attach on the outside of this cockpit combing, probably just to some little snaps out here. So I want to be able to get to the snaps out here. I mean, I guess I could just, well, this is all that's the length anyway, is this right here. So probably like a snap there and then a zipper probably is what I'll do like a snap right here and then unzip and then zoop, get out huh? there's some lead weights on it. like some bags or something right or it could snap onto the inside of that yeah. true but I'm not gonna figure that out I'll, I'll, this, yeah I'm gonna do the zipper for first I'm gonna figure out the zipper on this one and then I'm, but I'm not gonna do the zipper over here until I've got this one aligned up and then I'll do these. There you go. So. Uh, How's the glass work out on the wood? Does it hit the wood? Yeah, the glass hits the wood on the two sides, so I gotta raise those up also. Maybe cut them on an angle. Uh, no, I don't need an angle. Oh, but okay. I, I, will need, I will need a hand though. Okay. Um, to mark the very front one for the angle. Can't wait to get your face. Oh. <laughs>